So I got something like this again. Uh, so uh, so you know, like it's sometimes when uh, like a uh, 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 some random email shows up to you saying that oh your product or like being sent like so I had to deal with this like on some uh, Apple purchase that uh, like for like three i iPhones uh so like the latest iPhones that that I never even bought and like uh and uh, three different versions like you know the color um so I tried contacting Apple and uh, they didn't pick up so yeah, I uh, we made a video on uh, uh, spazzing about this guy, uh, so. So, this time, I'm, uh, I got something from uh, Nort, something about Norton, about something like the looking, looking like this, so, uh. Someone named the on Alfonso uh, Stukes. Uh, okay, uh, okay. So this is through my uh, business business email, uh, which uh, I have already had to u deal with. Uh, People are uh, pitching, uh, uh, sending, uh, you know, uses like emails that are telling me to contact them, but yeah. Of course, I didn't fall, fall for that, though. I'm not that stupid, though. So, anyways, uh, apparently, there's something about uh, uh, my one year membership for Norton Protection has been uh, renewed. Uh, and the charge will be uh, reflected within the tw next 24 hours uh, to 48 hours on, on my uh, account. And, uh, and uh, some random purchase that I didn't even make. So. Wait a second. So, uh, I've seen a Mark Rover, you know, the guy who used to work for uh, NASA, and then also Apple, Jim Browning, who's uh, also like, uh, you know, who's found a way to reverse the signal that ha the, sp the scammers uh, send to uh, victims uh, to try to steal Mark take money, steal money from them so there's like that situation and uh, and also uh progy from us uh, scammer payback who uh i've been been at uh, i've been uh, fighting back against uh scammers in india so uh Uh, they have a uh, show now. Uh, so I've seen it on the Mark Rover uh, video. So uh, and that yeah, apparently uh, they will not make. So they'll show you like an email like uh, they, like that, and uh, so they'll tell you to call a certain certain toll free number. And uh, you know it'll type go and lead you to a website. And you call that, and then they'll. You know, trying to like, you know, work your way through, uh, so there's going to be like the people, uh, faking, uh, like, uh, like, uh, pretending like they're working from, uh, Microsoft, uh, Apple, uh, Norton, Norton, uh, and a whole bunch of other companies, uh, so, yeah.
and you see something like, oh, like there's a certain payment like this, like, like a number like that, they'll tell you to call that, and as and it's usually a scammer. It's a scammer from uh, India or some other country trying to steal your money from you. So they'll of course they're gonna you know once they got your number you know you're in danger because they're going they could pass that on to other scammers or also use that for other scams. As uh, I am uh, been I have uh, looked up. Uh, on the videos, uh, so because once they got your name uh, and uh, phone number and uh, and also uh, bank account information, uh, so if because of course they're going to like ask for you uh, like a uh, bank number, so uh, you know, bank account details. Uh, of course, they got that in, in their hands. They're going to steal money from you. So, uh, usually, uh, so, so and it's kind of strange because, uh, because last time, uh, when uh, I, I, an email like this was uh, sent to me, uh, Microsoft was working with uh, Forcepoint uh, on a security uh, company uh, that uh, like uh, detects like uh, any scams, uh, hacks, uh, anything. So, so this time they didn't do anything. So if you see something like this, and of course you didn't make a you know make a purchase, uh, and I am not a Norton user. My dad showed me like a certain. Uh, uh, Korean uh, owned uh, free uh, security uh, thing uh, so and also there's also a security uh, system that you can also use uh, on uh, that that you can use for your computer or laptop so So there's uh, something that you know, I should uh, do. Obviously, uh, you can't don't delete it because uh, they're gonna uh, they're gonna send it to you again uh, and again and again through uh, ob the other emails uh, with the same same flavor text and uh, yep, they won't give up until they got your bank your name your phone number your bank account information and yep. So see how there's a uh, junk on that, uh, you know, mark marking is like pishing now. Uh, so blocking, marking is this junk, or blocking will not do anything. It will not absolutely not make a difference. So if you really want to hit them, hit them hard, and uh, make sure they can't send can't send it to you. You'll see something like this. Pishing scams. Keep your your information and others' information safe. Mm -hmm. So, report. Bye bye. I actually learned about that Norton uh, scam uh, thing. Uh, uh, that uh, pierogi from a uh, scammer payback uh, told him told me. Uh, Told up that I talked about, and I
And uh, I have uh, had to like uh, knock off some uh, Apple uh, stuff that, that uh, has been sent to me uh, previously. Uh, So I did uh, call the certain number, but they didn't pick up. So, because uh, you know the number was uh, in, uh based in a um and in the you know, USA somewhere. So uh, of course it would uh, take a while for them to get a hold of me. So. So when uh, when you're like uh, using a, like sort of a, like an email like Microsoft, then uh, Force Point doesn't uh, step in or like uh, and uh, checks that email before you do. And I just got this uh, that email uh, today, so and if oh I'm just gonna. Weird uh, emails like uh, like right like this one uh, And someone and this person was like literally uh, looking at it. Uh, I think they're they're asking me for money. So that that email was automatically put in, put in my uh, my junk mail by uh, by uh, Force Point the mic and Microsoft. So it's gonna be deleted and. So this is the first time I actually got that uh, notice, so like that note one uh, by uh, by somebody, but I I know it's a scam. Like they're trying to like scam me because you know I've seen. I will not fall victim to these people. So if you see like a phishing email like that, like uh, do not like uh, give any of your like a personal information or try to like you know. And I feel bad for like every like every victim uh, who has uh, fallen to uh, has been uh, scammed by scammers that. Uh, in uh, India for the, because of this and uh, you know the people Indians actually hate these uh, scammers in India and yeah they hate them too don't fall for them that mistake <laughs> 